Hey there, this is Katherine Cartwright. Welcome. I am sharing some product from Diamond Press. This is the Merry Holiday Card Insert Collection. This is part of Craft Day over at hsn.com that they are releasing. These are going to be for the inside of your card. However, I found that they work great for the um, outside of your card as well. And so it comes with a full color um, page showing all of the sentiments. I'm going to kind of flip through them. I'm sorry if they don't show up the best when I recorded this. Um, it's been a while ago and you may not be able to see everything perfectly, but um, I tried. <laughs> but there are a ton of them. They're in vellum. They're also in cardstock and some of them have foil. They're foiled in either gold or silver. And then some of them are five by seven. Some of them are what I would call an A2 sized that would go into your standard A2 size card. Uh, some of them are pl pr printed with black ink, um, but really, really nice. And then there's some in slimline shape as well. And um, those are really fun as well. So, and then some of them, I should say, are you would cut them apart. You could cut them into pieces. You could use some dies to cut them out, maybe some circles. You can see some of these are smaller. Um, and this is wishing you a season of blessings. Very, very pretty. And lots of them. I'll have to link. I'll link it in the description. I don't know exactly how many sentiments you get. Um, but very nice quality. Well done. And if you struggle with finishing off the insides of your cards at the holidays, this is a great product to use. You also could turn these into tags if you wanted, if you had some tags, um, because there are so many. If you use all of these, um, I want to know because it means you made a ton of holiday cards. So if you do, if you use this whole package on cards, uh, let me know because I have got to know who you are and how you made so many cards uh, because there's so many in this kit. Lots of different fonts too, I should mention. Um, so just a lot of variety and a fun thing to add to your card collection. And I'm just measuring that. These are for the A2 size that will fit in your A2 size. And A2 size, we say that a lot. I say that a lot in my videos. Um, that is four and a quarter by five and a half is a finished card. But you could trim even these down if you wanted these a little smaller. If you didn't want this to take up the entire inside of your card, you could do that as well. You could just use your trimmer and cut them down or you could um, use a die, like a rectangle or a square would be great. And here are some of these slimline in this beautiful vellum. You could use um, some of your diamond press adhesive sheets that you get in every set now. You could use some of those to apply these. You could use um, a spray adhesive if you prefer that. Um, there are some glues out there that will work on vellum. I have never really found one that worked well for me, but they are out there. So maybe you have some in your craft stash that you could use. You could also use the old technique. What I call the old technique is if you want to put this on the front of a card, punch a couple of holes at the top and run a ribbon through it. That's very old school. I've been card making a long time and I remember before there were any kind of good adhesives to attach vellum that you couldn't see all through the back of your card. Um, on the card front, I should say, you would punch a hole and thread your ribbon through. I mean, we're talking really old school. So you could do that. I did that with uh, one of my daughter's um, birth announcements uh, when we still made those kind of things. At least I did. Uh, probably 18, 20 years ago. So that's a way to add um, add them to your card as well. You could go totally old school. Leave me a comment. Let me know if you've ever done that technique too. I should pull that out. I should have made a card with that. Um, and then this is another page. You can see these, um, what I'm going to call cut aparts that you could use for all different sizes. Again, these would be awesome on tags. Cut them down and add them to a, a die cut tag. Um, that you may have in your craft stash. And here it is with the gold. How beautiful. Um, so a ton of them in this kit. And there's also, I've got another video, but it's also, um, there's like a Hello You, I think is the name of it. All the names are kind of running together at this point. But um, you can see how much you get in this set and the value is really great. Here are a couple of samples I made. If you're interested, check the description. 
um, and head over to hsn.com. Diamond Press is on there a lot today. Thanks so much for watching and happy crafting.